Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. No nothing. It's all sensors. And this is the roof. Alright, let's see. Back. Oh my god. You guys actually got to see the front before I did. Because I didn't even know I was opening it that way. Look at this. It's freaking amazing. And it's freaking hot. Oh my god, the quality is just crazy. Like, it's pretty heavy actually. No, oh, no, it's actually, look, it's actually light. That looks so cool. Doesn't it? First of all, this is my, sewing, my first sewing machine, like I said, guys. And I didn't really have any type of knowledge prior to ordering a sewing machine. And I looked into like, what are some of the requirements a beginner sewing machine should have gonna make it easier for you to be able to learn if it has these certain things on their website it tells you specs and what sewing machines they recommend for beginners here are some of the specs on it this one is called the project runway limited edition computerized sewing machine it has 165 built-in stitches, including 55 alphanumeric letters, and then eight one-step auto size buttonhole styles, and it has an LED work light. Another thing you guys should be looking out for is the advanced easy needle threading system. That is going to help you be able to thread your needle easier and faster another thing it, it includes a jam resistant quick set drop in top bobbin that was something that every person i watched emphasized on was the drop in top bobbin 
is going to help you have less jams and it's better to have a see-through clear drop in bobbin area so that you can see when your thread runs out it comes with a manual and a bunch of stuff that you can i'm pretty sure i'm going to be looking back at this a lot so this comes out you slide it and then it opens like Christmas. I'm pretty sure these are different needles based on what type of fabrics you can use these on. We've got these green ones. There's, oh, this is a double. Oh, cool. It comes with a double needle. That's cool. I didn't, I didn't really see what this came with, to be honest with you guys. Like, I didn't look at, like, the accessories much. I was really focused on, like, the specs. I'm pretty sure other stuff that I just can't think of on top of my head, but I'll let you guys know if I remember. Um, this is called an organ needle. Oh, it comes with extra bobbins. I didn't... Cool. Also, another important thing that I heard was to only use bobbins that belong to your sewing machine. Don't use bobbins that are not made for it or any other kinds of bobbins because it can mess up your sewing machine. Wow, so this is my sewing machine. And as you can probably guess, you will probably start seeing more sewing content on my channel. I'm excited to learn how to sew and create, maybe open a little shop of my own. And definitely create content around it. I think that's one of the biggest things. All right, so that concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching. I already have my first project in mind. So I think I'm just gonna tackle that as soon as I get some thread to match what I'm thinking. And I will definitely bring you a video if you want. So just comment down below to let me know if you guys want some more content on sewing. My next video is probably going to be on how to thread your machine. So make sure you subscribe to my channel. Click on the notifications button so that you can be notified for my next video. That way you don't miss it. If you are still subscribed to my channel after two years of me not posting, you're a real MVP. You're no G. Like, you're the realest of the realest. Like, I love you for that. You're awesome. Thank you. I appreciate it. Make sure you like the video if you happen to enjoy yourself at any point in this video. Oh, and check out my socials. They will be up here at that being so. Follow me on Instagram. Okay? Follow me on here. And have a great rest of your day. I love you so much. And you're dope. Don't ever forget that. Okay?